All right, right here is a crown and buckle Chevron NATO strap, which is very similar to the original Tudor strap. Just uh, you can tell by the knit right there. Super well done. You can see kind of the dark blue with the black and then the olive stripe down the middle. This is um, an original Tudor buckle. So it actually doesn't come with the buckle that looks like this. I just um, replaced it with the Tudor buckle that I have. So I've been using this on my Black Bay. But um, there's another strap that's been really popular online. You'll see a lot of people posting about it. And these are these um, straps that are made out of, uh, I believe it's like a parachute material. These are Erica's Originals. Um, they are now branded on the buckle, but before she uh, kind of blew up on Instagram, um, they were being sold without the branding. So picked this one up on a watch forum and wanted to see what it looked like on the Black Bay. So first things first, uh, this is a elastic, so you can see it stretch right there. And the way this strap works is you have these two sides right here. And then when you're ready, this buckles over and then clips in like that. So then that is your strap. So let's actually see what this looks like on the Black Bay. So here it is on the Black Bay 36. You can see it uh, just pinch up a little bit on the sides because the strap is 20 millimeters, whereas the lugs on the Black Bay are 19 millimeters. Looks really good. Um, fits well because it's elastic and it stretches out. So as your wrist changes size throughout the day, this kind of expands. Keep in mind though that if you do order one, you want to make sure you consider the size. If you order it on her website, she asks for a wrist measurement because of the way this is sized. So some people like the buckle to be like down at the bottom. So then you're going to want to have the appropriate size for that. Um, this one, I mean, the buckle is going to come up a little higher than I'd like, but um, I don't mind too much. So it's not like a NATO in the sense that it's adjustable because you'd have to actually um, get this shortened if you needed it to be a shorter strap. And here it is on the wrist. Getting really comfortable. Um, I'm actually going to need this one a little bit shortened because I think I do want it a little bit tighter. So I'm going to probably um, undo the ends right here and then re-sew it. But just a really comfortable strap and a different type of strap. So um, these look great on Speedmasters and other kind of tool watches. The Black Bay is known to, or this Black Bay, you can dress up or dress down, so it actually really works well with this.